Hi, I'm Jerry Gagne from Toys Pet Supplies. We're the oldest pet supplies company in the United States, dating back to 1887. Today is November 11, 2011. And we're here with you a couple of folks in the Ohio Mass in Columbus, Ohio. And I think if you want to this link and you click on it, you know what I'm But if you click on it, there'll be all kinds of pictures of the birds that are here. We have stocks, we have beef, we have turkey, and we have chicken. Sitting with me is Tim Johnson, who is president of the Ohio the Ohio National and the club has 800, almost 900 members. The secretary of the club is Eric Malarkey, and we're here just to kind of deal with some of the things, the history of the company, the history of the show and the club itself. Eric is nice enough to let me some notes. I'm not doing this professionally, as you saw in the talk, but we're here to talk about the show with I think a lot of our, our customers are toys aren't aware of it, so maybe they might want to be involved with the next year. The Ohio National has been going on for 56 years, a long time. The interesting thing happened, Eric is talking to the and just listening. Eric, tell me what happened. How it grew, and then all of a sudden it blew up. Yeah, in, in the 1960s, the show was uh, uh, one of the biggest every year. And then in the 70s, uh, they had a joint national show with the ABA and the uh, APA. APA means American Band Association and the American Pickle Association. And at that point, they grew to about 3,500 birds. In there. And then in 2006, the growth has just taken off. And we've gone from that 3,500 birds to around 5,000 or more every year with over 400 exhibitors every year. And we wrote in a that. In, was it 1998 that you set the record? Yeah, in 1998, the High National set the largest open show ever held in the Western Hemisphere. Uh, it was uh, 4,292 birds in the show. A lot of uh, people who do this kind of thing would pay for the background that we have, the noise. What you're hearing is the show. You're going to hear the ducks cackling, you're going to hear the roots is flowing. Uh, it's great atmosphere, I think. The president of the club, Tim, I just found out you both, he became president in 1999, and he became secretary in 1999, and at the same position as the club. Tell me a little bit about the club, the membership, the name of the club, how to contact the folks that are interested in joining. Well, we're typically known as Ohio National, but it's actually it's the Ohio Poultry Breeders Association, and we sponsor the Ohio National. The Ohio Poultry Breeders Association is, like we stated before, it's 800 members in our club. We're kind of a close-knit, friendly organization. We're always looking for new members. And we just, we get along good. We have, we have good fun. Me and Eric, uh, typically through the year, we probably talk once or twice a month, and then as the show gets closer, talk more and more, more and more and more. And, you know, it, it's, it's hard work and dedication of our people that make this show what it is today. It's just, do you, you don't have to be an Ohio person to be a member of the club, or do you have to live in Ohio? No, you do not have to be an Ohio person to be a member of our club, but we do have the regulation that you have to be an Ohio resident to be a club. Yep. So what I'm going to do, folks, is be interested in contacting folks about the show in the future, about joining the club, you might want to get yourself a pencil, piece of paper, we're going to give you a website, or excuse me, an email address, and also a website also, yep. a website that you can click on and get the kind of information that you need. So get that piece of paper, and boy, you can also, you can repeat this, can't you? You can play it once and come back and get your pencil and paper. I'm not a computer person, so we're struggling through this. Okay, the show is held when? Uh, typically, it's the second weekend in November every year. Mm -hmm. When we keep that schedule, it hasn't changed since 98, really. So, the second weekend of November, if you folks are listening and interested, maybe uh, on your calendar, mark it, keep it in mind, I'm sure they'd love to see it. Even if you don't want to show to them, or poultry, or, or fowl, or game birds, or waterfowl, mm. or <laughs> parking. 
It's just a lot of fun to come here. If you can imagine 5,000 animals, 5,000 birds in the same building, every kind of bird that you can think of when it comes to a culture, this is where you want to be. 5,000 birds. If you have a doctor you'd like to see a particular breed, a doctor picking, whether it be a phantom, whether it be a standard chicken, they are here. Make yourself some time to come. We're going to wrap this up. Once again, my name is Jerry Downey, Boys Pet Supplies. If you want to get a hold of the folks here in regards to the Ohio National or maybe joining the club, the website, www.http slash slash ohionational.org. If you want more information, if you need an email address, it's Johnson, that's J-O-H-N-S-O-N, Johnson, at ohionational.org. If you need more information about FOIS, put a little plug in for us. Of course, if you're watching this, it's a link to FOIS, but our phone number, area code 877-355-7727. Kim, thank you. Thank you, Jerry. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Hope it all works.